Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel and hello to all my new subscribers. Thank you so so much for everyone that is new here and has recently subscribed. I really appreciate it. So I am bringing you today a huge, well it's not that big but I mean you should have seen the bag that, that it all came in was literally the size of me. I'm bringing you a misguided haul and I have really been digging through the sales this year. Normally I'm not one for sale items but I have been looking this year and I found quite a few deals and quite a few good quality things so I want to share them with you and I'm going to do so in this video. So this is all misguided sale items and we're going to start off with this item that I'm wearing. So this is a two piece. It's a top which also has a hood and it comes with bottoms as well. I'll stand back in a minute but just so you get a bit of a better view. These are the bottoms. So they're matching and they're super, super cosy. They're not see-through actually. Well, I'm hoping they're not in this light. But in my bedroom, I was I was trying to see if they were see-through and they didn't look it. But these lights make a lot of things see-through. So I'm sorry if they are. I think you can see a label somewhere. Yeah, look. But um, overall, they're not that see-through. I've had worse of things. Yeah, this is a cute two-piece that I got. However, they had other colours. But this colour was, I think, reduced more than the other colour. Now, I'm not sure why that is. I don't know if it's because they're struggling to sell this colour. Um, that's why they put the price down. But yeah, I did notice that and I did wonder why so I could only think that's the reason um, but I mean this is a nice enough colour it's like a beigey brown um, and the quality is really soft as well so yeah let's put the hood up see what the hood's like oh yeah this is super cosy um, the top is cropped I think did they have a baggier top I'm not sure. I will put pictures on screen, but um, yeah, this is kind of like a cropped hoodie, by the way, so it's not going to cover your bum. So if that's what you want, then um, don't get this because your bum is pretty much on full display. So, <laughs> um, but yeah, this I thought this was a super nice, cosy two-piece. I got the bottoms in, I think, a small. Let me just double check. Yeah, I got them in a six to eight because this material, which you probably know, is really stretchy. Um, so whenever I ordered trousers in this material, I'd always obviously get my normal size, which is like a 10 or a 12. When they come, they are very loose because it's that material. So I thought this time I'm gonna size down and I would never order trousers in a six to eight. I would never, ever, ever get my thighs in them. But with this material, you can. So just bear that in mind that if you are like me, you're a 10 to 12 and you want them to be a little bit more fitted, then you need to size down. The length of the trousers are quite long, so I do have to roll them up. They are um, tighter at the bottom, like around the ankle, but I can't leave them like that because the trousers is going to sag over so I've had to, I don't know if you can see, um, I've had to like roll them up quite a few times so yeah I'm 5 foot 3 I would say um, so yeah if you're around my height you're going to have to roll the trousers up which is pretty much what I have to do for every trouser that I own. And let me just tell you what size I ordered the top in. Oh yeah, the top I got a 10 to 12 because I didn't want it to be too tight. I wanted it to be quite like cosy and baggy. So yeah. A lot of the items in this haul, by the way, are like lounge outfits. So yeah, pretty much everything I'm going to show you is something you can 
just pop out in, chill at home in, go to the cinema in, just really super comfy wear. So the next outfit is a two piece and it's shorts and a long top set. Now it looked really nice on the model and it does look really nice in person and it's very good quality as well. However, I probably wouldn't wear it out. I feel like this one is kind of kept for indoors um for me personally so the top's long and then you've got the shorts that are matching um i'll just show you the length of them can you see so yeah you see what i mean by this is kind of like an indoor just comfy lounge set um i mean you could pair this top with something else on the bottom and wear it out but these shorts i personally wouldn't wear out but yeah, the top 100% you could pair this with jeans, you could pair this with anything. It's just a nice, like the quality of it is really nice. I can't believe I got this in the sale. I wish I could remember how much everything was, but I can't. So you guys will be able to see it on the screen. So sizing, I got the top in a 10 and the bottom in a 10 as well so 10 10 and i think they fit perfectly to be honest um really nice for just lounging around and being all cozy this outfit i have had my eye on for so long but never bought and when i saw it was in the sale i was like oh my god i need this i don't think it was reduced that much in the sale but when i saw it was in the sale i was like okay i need to get it now it's honey bunny on the front and i didn't realize how ballooned the sleeves were like i'm literally obsessed with these balloon sleeves at the moment so yeah when i put it on i was like oh my god i didn't realize it had balloon sleeves but um Yes, I am obsessed with this jumper. This, I think, would be getting a lot of use out of it. I did think it would be long enough to wear as like a jumper dress, but it's not really. Um, I would definitely pair a pair of black cycling shorts underneath it, because that would just, then you could technically wear it as a jumper dress, couldn't you? Just with a little pair of cycling shorts underneath it. So yeah, I'll definitely be doing that. Let me show you the length of it. So yeah, it's quite short, so I don't, I wouldn't feel comfortable wearing it with nothing underneath it. It comes in other colours. I think it comes in like a pinky colour, but I opted in for the nude ones. So it's got like nude, white, black, nude, and then the writing is in the nude, or like a dark nude. Um, but yeah, I love this. What size did I get it in? I got this in a 12 because I wanted it to be oversized. And it does the trick and the quality it's like it is thin but it's not like thin thin i know that's really hard to understand i'm sorry but it's hard to describe the material like it's good material put it that way it's not like your primark thin that's a good comparison it's not your primark thin but it's not like your like really expensive thick material um it's the material that you kind of want for a jumper like this so yes i highly recommend you get one of these because they're so cute so when i saw this t-shirt in packaging i was looking at it and i was thinking oh my god what is all that stuff over it like they've sent me a dirty t-shirt and then i remembered that this is the pat like this is the pattern on the t-shirt um it kind of looks like a paint t-shirt you know like some people keep t-shirts that they wear for like painting it's this is what it looks like so i hope you guys can see yeah look this is the style of the t-shirt don't know if i'm feeling it on the website as you will see on screen now it didn't look that bad but now it's on me, I feel like I've just gone out in a dirty t-shirt. And I I'm, I'm, don't remember it saying misguided on the front of it either. I don't know. 
it's it's a longish t-shirt longish t-shirt i'd probably if i was to wear it pair it with joggers or again some cycling shorts but i don't know if i'm gonna keep this one i mean i'll show you the length of it so yeah it's it's longish not long enough to wear on its own but it really does look like I've gone out in like my dad's painting t-shirt or something so I yeah don't think I'm gonna keep this one um not sure what you guys think of this but it didn't look that bad on the website where's the tag I've got this in a size medium, uh, fits perfectly, but yeah, I don't know if I'm feeling this whole painting t-shirt kind of look. So this item is quite random. They're all quite random outfits because they're something that you can pair with other things that you own. Um, they're just bits that I saw in the sale that I quite liked. So this was one of them. It's super, super creased, but I'm not going to get the iron out now and iron it. Um, but it's a long t-shirt. It is classed as a t-shirt as well. But I think I got it in quite a big size. Yeah, so I got this in a size medium. I actually thought this was a large because it is quite big. But I would personally wear this with you could wear this with a roll neck underneath it you could wear it with cycling shorts you could wear it with joggers joggers it may look a little bit too baggy because you'd be tucking it in and there would be a lot of bagginess which would then restrict you from seeing the print on the front so probably wouldn't wear it with joggers i would if it was a smaller size but i think with the size of this it might not look that good with joggers but you could try it. Yeah, cycling shorts and a roll neck underneath it. I think that would look quite cool. The arms are quite long, so I'd probably need to roll these up. But yeah, this, there's so much you could do with this top, I think. It's got a lot of potential. Now, what does this say on the front? I'm trying to read it. I can't read upside down, but I don't even know print of a st lady statue or something i just thought it was really cool and i think it was quite cheap as well on the sale so yeah another random outfit from holly so this is what was making my misguided bag so bloody heavy this jumper weighs a ton <laughs> but the quality of it is so nice it's so soft but yeah it's really weighty weighs you down um i love this this i think was the only color you could get this in for like the cheaper sale price but there's nothing wrong with this color this is like a what would you like a mustardy yellow more on the lighter side of must mustard i'd say mustard color um i think the other colors were slightly more again assuming that they're struggling to sell this color but i like it i think it's really nice um as i said the quality of it is really nice and thick perfect for the cold weather coming up it is quite long as well i got it in a 10 to 12 so because i do quite like my jumpers to be like fairly oversized so i personally would wear this with you could wear it with level up jeans normal leggings normal jeans um i don't think you could tuck this might be a bit thick to tuck into like shorts but yeah there's quite a few things you could wear this with um i'll show you the length see that so yeah it's nice and big it's got that little bubbles on it it does say to take care of it when you're washing it so i'll have to check on the best way to wash this because you don't want to ruin it it's so warm as well i think you would have to wear 
something underneath it because I mean I've got nothing on underneath it so if I was to go out in the cold I think I would feel it through the holes so maybe like put like a little vest up underneath it or something just to give you that extra bit of coverage because look you got these big holes here so you would want to wrap up or like layer up underneath just to keep yourself extra warm but yeah love this so chunky like this is a proper thick chunky jumper and sadly it is my last outfit that i'm showing you so yeah this was just purely random comfy items that i found in the misguided sales i've never dig so deep in a sale before like as i said i'm not normally a sale person i don't i try and avoid the sales if anything but now i think i'm gonna look out for the sales because you can actually like going into the shop is a different story i think if you're going in store and looking through the sales that is painful but if you're online it don't really make no difference does it but i'm getting a really dry throat now from talking i need a drink so yes i really hope you enjoyed watching if you did, don't forget to like this video and subscribe if you want to see more from moi. I upload twice a week and I'm really struggling to speak. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next one.